we're gonna try setting something yellow on a I don't know, flat wall. <laughs> on a flat wall? Like vertical. Perfectly vertical? Perfectly vertical. So we're gonna go for fun, good stuff. But V1, like this, like. Like V1 crimps? V1 crimps. Pinches and maybe a heel hook or two. I love heel hooks. Can we put a monkey toe in? Monkey toe? This is where you use your that toe hook to like a heel hook after you already have a heel hook. So what's your process like? You decide Mine, I kind of let the holds decide the fate of the route. And if I can get a bunch of the same holds to match, then it feels like it flows better to me. Because then you're not going from bah, crimps to, oh, it's a nice job. <laughs> oh, it's a fatty pinch. You can have like fatty pinch, fatty pinch. You can heel hook that other fatty pinch up to another fatty pinch. <laughs> It's just a process. Everybody does it different. And I really don't feel like dragging this whole bucket out to the stuff. So I'm going to pick about 10 holds and that are semi, same kind of texture, same kind of feel that I like, and try to work them all into one thing. We're kind of low on crimpy routes right we now. We did get an absolute ton. Of screw hogs. Dude, that, I love the. Those are such precise feet, though. I like those. Are you I, thinking two feet? <laughs> I was gonna to like go on the side of that arete and just like. And you just, I like that. That'd be cool. That'd yeah, be, it's kinda, that, that might be when we need a hard grade. I don't want stuff hard to do. Hmm. <laughs> v1, 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 V1. That. That. Look at the banana. <laughs> Eat it. Oh, but that's like V1 uh, crimp level, right? Sweet. <laughs> Alright, so we got basically one pinch so far. I was hoping there'd be more pinches in here. Yeah. Really not. We got some jugs. We might just try doing like a flowy jug route with an underclean. Just bad feet and jugs. Yeah. That sounds good. So we have a bunch of jugs. Need to get utilized. We're gonna we're gonna put this sucker back. I don't we have enough slopey problems already, man. I know. Since Chan so just just put like a ton of these on his feet with really really good hands, just make people campus. <laughs> Like the worst idea ever. <laughs> jugs on jugs on jugs. I wish we had one of those really, really big jugs, not drugs. Dual pan things. What? Jugs, not drugs? That'd be a cool t shirt. <laughs> uh, hey, what does your shirt say? Oh, it's, uh, oh, wait, it's not for drugs. <laughs> <laughs> Why haven't they utilized all these volumes? I don't know, we could use a couple of them today, that'd be fun. Make easy problems that they can... Volumes are... you gotta make sure they're secure to the wall, and That's a lot in of... some spots you wanna make sure there's no fall hazard. That's a lot of work. It's not a lot of work, it's just some people don't like doing it. Is that I'd right? love to use that green one, because it's a really cool spot I wanted to use it on, go up to it. But then Kevin's gonna yell at you. No, there's... <laughs> Ergo, why well, have on my shoe? Let's put volumes back in the slab row. <laughs> See, I'm nice. I like big feet. Mm, that's more like slopey feet. Better than nice. <laughs> There's another foot. Look at that. What? We'll see how it goes. So nice. To we'll be see how cool. it goes. Try to make some fun movement and maybe not spill all these tiny little chippers. And e. Oh, 
Oh, do you get the accurate amount of bolts instead of just a smattering of bolts? No. Yes, yes, that's all I do. I'm a I'm, little different. Yeah. I'm not making fun of you. I'm just, like, you're the first person I have met that does that. No, I don't like walking back here five different times trying to find the right size bolt for what I need. So I just get every bolt for every hole, take it out, and then you don't have that. Which I'm not saying that's a bad thing. Sometimes you need that when you just have a handful of holes. And you always want to make sure you got enough in there. Not like, yeah, that'll catch the T-nut, but you put weight on that, it's not Break the T-nut. You want to have a nice little grip into that T-nut, and then on these there's set screws. You always want to make sure you have set screws. When you don't, you know, Oh, God! <laughs> but that's too much. So then the hole's gonna do this. Too much on the spin. Shouldn't you be able to just like immediately pick the right bolt by now, Andy? Dude, I haven't been to the gym in two months. I'm still recovering. That sounds like excuses today. <laughs> I know what those holes are down there. Mr. Watch your little bolt. His feet. Just like getting weird. Hi, Miss Molly. How are you? I'm good. You wanna help me? Yeah, you should help us. We need a short person. I was like, no. <laughs> Why'd you take that that block off there? She has the grade that I have on the other holds. It's not going to be consistent with what grade that is after that move out to that. So I'm going to go back and get that fatty pinch because then that'll kind of accommodate what the grade to hold ratio is. Bunch of feet multiple times and move multiple times. Hopefully for V1 with some flowy moves. people from the gym try it out. I think it's maybe a one. Yeah. If that. There's one that one big move out. Yeah. It's gonna be the it's like the only hard move I think. It might be a two if it's it feels really nice though that underclean super good. So you start out going right hand and kinda go into this little off and on or not really off and on but it's like a little gaston juggy. For your left, and you go right up into that right under cling, and you pull up to that mini jog. 
Then you do this nice kind of bring your core in by attention to the pinch, cross on, do it to secure the hold. Move your feet over and step up to last hold. I'm gonna add another foot for shorter people for last hold, that's about it. That works. When people screw in foot chips, it's such good footage. Oh, is it? That's like the best footage. <laughs>